Bwahahaha! Hello everybody, how is it hanging? Today we are going to be griefing this bridge. Here we go. Oh my goodness, this is going to be amazing. Yes. Yes. Let me just remove my trace. Wait, what? How can this be? The bridge is repairing itself! This can only mean one thing. Robert Bauman is a genius. <laughs> Hello, everybody. That skit was indeed true. I am a genius because I've devised, well, not devised, with help from a YouTube from a YouTube video I watched. I have devised. I learned how to make a you know just regular self-repairing bridge, but then I did a second generator, uh, so that I did repair at double the speed. Have this set at one tick instead of three. Or instead of two, so it goes twice as fast that way. And then I have all these under repeaters so they run at the exact same time and it's just a lot better. And uh and I'm gonna show you how to make it in this video. It is very, very simple. So let me just take a a part at the redstone really quickly, because that's the part that mostly annoys people, so I'll be right back. Alright, so this is as much as I'm gonna take out. Um it's very simple, the wiring, and I have this here only to identif uh, identify where my clock was, because I don't want to forget, really. Um, so, here we go. This is basically how it works. What you want to do first is set up the clock, or at least that's what I like to do first. And to do that, you just need four repeaters. So, wait, there. Set some redstone. Put another repeater here. Oh yeah, and you want these all, I want these all in first tick. That's how I do them. Let me put this here. First tick. Here. First tick. And there. Now you just distribute the redstone, basically. Full tick. Oh yeah, you want this all in full tick. Trust me, it's a nightmare if you don't have all these on full tick. It just does not work nearly as well. By the way, the reason I'm not taking out the gen generators because generators are fairly easy to build. All you do is separate the lava and water by one. Put the piston back here, one away. Put this cobble here before you set the lava and water. You set the lava and water and they meet right here. And I have this little block right here so that when they start, but I don't really need it anymore. So, and then you just do the same on the other side. Okay, and now take let's take it from over here. That switch does nothing, I just left it there to identify uh where the clock was so I wouldn't get it lost. Wait. Excuse me for one second. There. I'll do the repeaters afterwards. I don't feel like placing them as I go, just that much more time I could be saving with Geico. Um, take a little bit from here. Shove it up in this piston's ass. Take this out here. You want to try and keep this kind of compact. So you could save as much room as possible. But in this case, I'm not really going to try and do that. So if it's not, screw you guys. Anyway, um, you could leave that on first tick. It doesn't really matter. I'd recommend having it on first tick. But again, you can do whatever you want. Now I'm just going to maximize repeaters. Just... Just because safety comes first, and I don't want any of my viewers getting hurt. Because redstone is an electrical wire. In case you didn't know. Derp, 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 derp to those of you who didn't know that. Um, there. That should be good. So first things first, I'm going to remove all of this here. Is that a good idea? No. 
I'm gonna move up to here. And then to here. Set air. The way I have it is that it comes protruding out of the water as opposed to uh, going above the water. It cuts square right through it. That's why it's all distorted like this because it, uh, it was at one point uh, flat, but now it just got cut off. So, um, now all you have to do is just start it up. All you have to do is uh, fire your lasers. Wait, actually, to maximize the effect of this video, I will remove as much as possible. Oh, okay, I guess that wasn't necessary, thank god. Uh, take that out. Take that out. And take this out. And I'm also going to show you how to start a clock, because that could be a pain in the balls. So you just drop a little redstone torch, but you have to pick it up really quickly. So, like, this clock started. And thanks to my discount double check bridge builder, my bridge will now be built. Wait, this is actually supposed to be grass or dirted. Are these all on fifth tick? Oh, and this is supposed to be on fifth, fifth tick too. Sorry, anyway, um, so that needs to be on final tick. Why is this not pulsating? One second. One second, let me stop the clock. Stop the clock, ref. Um, let me see, this is going through here. Should be starting the piston. There doesn't appear to be anything wrong with the piston. This runs along. This is the thing that isn't moving, and that's kind of scaring me. There. Maybe. Alright, maybe it's just not on long enough delay. Now let's try it. Because I know this is exactly how I had it built before, so I guess we'll find out. There we go. Fixed it. I just didn't have enough delay. There. So just to prove to you that it actually works, I'm going to... Wow, this one isn't on full delay. What's she order? Full delay. Moles. Uh, now I need another repeater for this. And this is how you build a double-sided self-regenerating bridge. Uh, I'm gonna speed, like, you know, speed up it regenerating itself, and that'll be it after this episode of Redstone Demonstrations. Alright, everyone, the bridge, as you can tell, is fully regenerated. Now over here I have a lava version, version except it doesn't protrude out of the water, it instead comes out above, so let me show you that it works just the same, it's just that it's hidden. This is though, this is a single version, it's not a double sided, so it works slightly slower, that's why it's a lot smaller. Um, but I think the actual redstone wiring, oh never mind, yeah that one's bigger because it's two sided. Um, but yeah, this one just goes a lot slower, and it comes above the lava as opposed to protruding through it, like this one. But anyway, you guys, that is this video on stuff. I'm going to end by stopping the clock, which isn't necessary. Bye-bye.